Hey everyone, Chris Adams here at the Twin Cities Elite Real Estate Group uh, here to bring you a video today for the top six things you need to consider when you're going to be purchasing land. So first thing that you need to figure out is, is that piece of land, that new piece you're looking to buy, is that going to be purely uh, something recreational or is that going to be something that you're going to build on? So that uh, is very important distinction on what you're going to be able to do. Uh, next thing that you want to take a look at there is just going to be, if you are planning on building, uh, what's the price of the house going to be? So it's a very good idea uh, just to start out right away, get the price of the house, uh, and that's going to help us dictate how much you can actually spend on that piece of land. Uh, number three, next thing you need to take a look at is what is the elevation of the land going to look like? So uh, some of the big things that you need to be able to take a look at uh, with your realtor would be, say for example, behind me here, you can see that there's a pond uh, right over there. So something like that it's important to take a look at to get a good idea of how far the elevation sits um, like this piece of property that we're specific specifically on right here uh, you can see that the elevation sits up quite high compared to this uh, a lot of our county GIS websites are going to help us uh, with kind of that uh, two foot elevation range uh, so we can figure out you know if you can have a basement or not uh, that's on the property so uh, number four thing to take a look at is how long uh, is your driveway going to be um, so how far back is that house actually going to sit so something super important to pay attention to especially if you're going to put a paved driveway in or an asphalt drive or excuse me a concrete driveway um, if you're looking to do that it's definitely going to affect the price of the house uh, and also bringing utilities back to there so uh, number five next thing to take a look at is uh, what direction is the house going to sit so wherever you're planning on putting the house so on this specific lot a house is going to end up going right back here uh, where we're sitting so uh, it's very important to look at that because when you're designing your next house uh, it's super important to figure out what that lighting is going to look like where is your bedroom is going to be um, where is your living room to be and how do you want that light to come into your house uh, fifth and final thing to take a look at is you just want to take a look at the neighbors homes uh, that are out there just to make sure that whatever you are planning on building uh, is going to fit into the neighborhood uh, that you'll be living in so super important to take a look at that a uh, couple other things that are out there too, if you do decide that you're just buying recreational land, we can absolutely help with that. A uh, whole different set of things that you're going to want to look at there, but feel free to reach out to the Twin Cities Elite Real Estate Group and we'll be more than happy to help you either uh, find that property for recreational purposes or the next house that you're going to build on. So thanks for watching and uh, feel free to comment down below and let us know if you have any questions. Thank you.